Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I have a couple of small, real small hauls that I'm going to do. One is uh, Dollar Tree and one is Michael's. So, I uh, will start with the Dollar Tree. First thing is I was hoping that I would be able to find these and we found them checking to make sure I'm recording. You know I have that issue every time. Okay, we found them finally yesterday. As I was walking in, I seen them. And it's these, um, the fall scented luminescence votive candles. I'm actually going to put them in my um, candle warmers that I have. This one smells good. It's um, blackberry rhubarb strudel. And there are four candles in each one. And they are by Luminescence. So, there's that one. And then I got two of these because, mmm, they smell so good. It's pumpkin cheesecake. Same Luminescence. And, like I said, I got two of those. So, there's that one. And then we got this one. It smells good, too. It's called Autumn Morning. It's just the green candle. Okay, and then something else that I've been seeing people haul. And I've seen them at the Dollar Tree that I go to the other day at the checkout. And I thought, because sometimes that's where they keep, um, like, things that you can pay a dollar for to donate for someone else that's in need. So I thought that's what they were doing. I thought they just had them up there for that. But it's this press to paste. And they actually didn't have any at my store. They had sold out. And the lady at the checkout, bless her heart, um, she had two put back for herself. And she gave up one because they didn't have any left. And this is what I was looking for. And it's freaking awesome, actually. It takes batteries. I done pulled it out of the package because I'm not a very patient person. So, and you just, you, let's see. Let me see how it works. I forget. You put your toothpaste in here and it like stands up. You stick it down in there and then you put the front on like that and then you stick your toothbrush in there and it pushes the toothpaste onto your toothbrush and it hangs on the wall. I thought that was a pretty cool thing and it also came with this bonus um, there's where you hang it it came with this bonus toothbrush holder. Look at that. It's just got the little things and it's got a cover to go over top of them so that nothing gets on them, you know. Things fly around in the bathroom. Ooh. Um, Alright, and then we went to Michael's to get a few things that we need for our DIY that we're going to be doing. And I hope you guys watch it because it's going to be fun. And I also got picked up a couple things that was on clearance. So, got this. It was on clearance. It was $8 marked down to $1.99. And it's just this, um, this is crafting tape. It's just little pink circles. It looks like washi, only it's a huge roll. So... And then the other thing I got on clearance, this was marked down from 15 to 4, what was it, 4, 4.59, 4.89, oh I'm sorry, 4.49, sorry, and it just says enjoy the ride, it doesn't have anything in it of course, it's not supposed to, you're supposed to add your own things, but look, it does have the, um, the little spandex pieces so that you can add your signatures in it so I thought heck yeah I'll get that and of course I almost backed out they had a green one too and I really liked it and my husband I almost backed out and my husband talked me into getting it I, I had the green one in the cart and then I took it out and put this one in and he's like get them both and I was like no quit trying to get me to be a bad girl he's like you know I support your habit and I said you mean my hobby 
your habit hobby. All right, and then we picked up this. Oh, this isn't from there. Where's the one from? Is this? No, that's not from. Oh, duh, because we went to Home Depot and Lowe's, both. So this one is from Home Depot, and it is the 18-gauge, 50-foot aluminum wire. That's for DIY. And we went to um, Lowe's first and couldn't find it. There goes my hair again. Look, it looks like I got a bald spot. But we found this. It is um, galvanized steel wire in 50 pound. Oh, 20 gauge. Sorry, but there's that. That's for a DIY. And then we went in Michaels. I'm sorry, I'm like mixing everything up. In Michaels, they had 40% off of all of their um, jewelry items. So we got these split rings that are for a DIY. And if, they, if things work out, we're probably going to be getting more off of the internet because you can find them a lot cheaper for a lot more and we also got these lobster clasps for a DIY same goes for these if it, if it works out we're going to be doing um, some internet shopping to get them a lot cheaper I mean they weren't much but it's a lot for 30 pieces in my opinion but but anyway I think that's it y'all oh and we also picked up a <laughs> teeny tiny little frying pan it was probably about that big it was called an egg fryer or something like that it's just like for one egg or a muffin or a um what it say a muffin or a bagel you can like warm them up and get them a little bit brown anyway okay i think that's it y'all oh and the i'm sorry the pan was from the dollar tree and we went to uh, Michael's kidney doctor this morning and found out that he is, um, his kidneys are down to 18% functionality. So, we have to be making a decision. He has to go back in two weeks and we have to decide what kind of dialysis he wants to go on. There's three different kinds. One, they'll put what he called a fistula in his arm, and it takes three months um, to mature. And so, if that's the one we choose, I mean, they pretty much got to put it in right away. And then there are two others that can be done, I think he said from home, right? Both of the other ones can be done from home. Oh, one of the other ones can be done from home. But it, you have to be, it like, has to be completely sterile um, and that that's scary to me so I don't know I think I would rather he get it done at the center but we're going to do some talking about it and, but he's finally to that point and we knew it was going to happen it just it sucks that it did so if y'all could say a little prayer for him um, and we're also going to be saying our prayers for all of the ones that are, have been affected by Hurricane Harvey. And then also by Hurricane Irma and the ones that are still in her path. Um, we'll be praying for you guys. Keeping you guys in our thoughts. Um, I can't imagine. I cannot imagine how you guys are feeling. Or what that would be like. I think that would be the most terrifying thing that anyone could ever go through one of them for sure so we will definitely keep you guys in our thoughts and in our prayers and um, just stay safe if you can evacuate evacuate don't stay your life is worth more than any you know object so all right well I think that's it guys just know that we're thinking about all of you and if you could keep my husband in your prayers and your thoughts um, and we will see you in our next video Bye. Thanks for watching.